And Carlos Viner calls it a Vietnam bath. All you need is a bottle of water. Make a little hole in the thing and hold it up, a little shower, put a little pinholes on the thing. It's just like a shower. He used the tactic to keep clean while serving in Vietnam and is using it again at his home in 2022. I didn't die in Vietnam. I'm going to die over here from water poisoning. Give me a break, please. Viner is among the residents of the Reese houses in the East Village who are relying on bottled water from the city because of elevated levels of arsenic detected in the water supply. He even went to the hospital because he started to feel sick. I said to my wife, you know, I don't feel good, man. The complaint started with cloudy, smelly water in early August. In response, NYCHA tested the water, which uncovered the toxic chemical. More testing is ongoing. In the meantime, NYCHA is providing water stations and bottled water to residents. A statement from the Housing Authority reads in part, quote, As we said Friday, there is no evidence connecting the arsenic levels to cloudy water. Out of an abundance of caution, however, we are advising Reese Houses residents not to drink or cook with the water in their buildings, and we are providing clean water for anyone who needs it. Additional samples were collected in apartments, roof tanks, and other locations today, and we are pushing to get results as soon as possible. No, come on. Don't tell me it's safe if you're going to tell me not to drink the water. It's not safe. I'm very angry. I am very angry because how, how does arsenic get in the water?